The universe of golf is heavily saturated with gadgets and innovations that often accomplish next to nothing except to get into your wallet and try to empty it out. But a couple years ago, I was first introduced to an innovation that will change your game forever. And that's what we're going to look at here in the moments ahead. Welcome to the amazing world of the Tempo Walk. It was at the 2019 PGA Merchandise Show in Orlando where I first laid eyes on the future of the game for those of you who enjoy walking. From Club Car comes the Tempo Walk, and it was named the product of the year at the PGA Show. John Bissell from Midwest Golf and Turf has been kind enough to bring us a, a unit to take a look at today. Oh, and, uh, man, this is fascinating. What's, what's the response been like? response has been great. Um, we've sold a lot of these Tempo Walks in the past literally the past month with everything that's going on in the, in the country and in the world for that matter. It's really been a great product for us. Well, how about while we're talking, you and I take that thing for sure. a walk and uh, we can get a look at how it actually operates. On yep. the back of John's belt is basically a little remote device about the size of a pack of gum. Yep. You Tra turn that thing on and it's good to go, right? Yeah, it's a transmitter that basically talks to the, to the walk while you're walking. Um, and it's always in communication with it. And each transmitter is married to the walk. So you can't, if can't. you have six at a facility, they, each one has its own transmitter. You're not going to run the risk of triggering somebody else's walk. Right, correct. I think a few of the questions that golfers in general might have would be tied into its responsiveness and how the whole thing works when I need to stop and hit a shot. So if we wanted to stop right here, you'll mm -hmm. see that the tempo walk will stop. And at that point, you turn the switch into sleep mode, if you will. Standby kind of Stand a thing. Standby, yeah. So then you're free to hit a shot, take a drink of water. There's a cooler there provided for water and or beverages. Um, so you hit your shot, you can go wherever you want, and the, the tempo walk will stay there. And when I get to the edge of the green, of course, I'm going to want to put it in the standby. Right. I'm going to take it across the green. But how yeah. about bridges and some of those areas that are a little bit more narrow for us? So I've used this. I've used the tempo walk several times um, on bridges and courses of that nature. And of course, being who I am, I always te I wanted to test it, and it does fine. Now that being said, there are automotive sensors on the walk. So and they go out at a little bit of an angle, just like a car. So if someone was to jump in between you and I it would stop and say sensor activated. Go ahead and go for a walk. Sure. I'm gonna cross in between John and the walk. Maybe I'm some sort of a, uh, some sort of an obstruction or just an annoying factor. It's stopping right there so that it doesn't run into me on that Correct. journey. You didn't do that, it did it automatically with the sensors that are built in around the edges of it. Correct. And as we come back up this way, uh, I'm also enamored by What's on it. the front of this thing? Yeah. Because one of the things we, we want to make sure of is the pace of play is strong. We can yep. always keep going. You've got a built-in GPS tablet on the front. Right, we do. That tablet, as you can see, it says the fortress where we're at today. But let's say we wanted to go to the Emerald at St. John's. We go to there and we plug it in and it's all GPS related. And you just plug in that golf course and they're preloaded so you can pick out any one you any course you really need to. Uh, I'm curious as to whether you're seeing a demand for the walk amongst consumers or courses, or is there a mix? Well, with with who we are right now, it's the golf courses. And we certainly would sell these to individuals, and we haven't done a lot of that. But as a club car partner, we want to get the, these into the golf courses' hands so they can recognize some of that revenue from a demographic of golfer that generally walks we can get that golfer to a pay for that because yep. it's a great experience right. they don't have to touch their bag it carries their water it charges their device so we want we're trying to get in the golf course's hands and let them recognize some of that revenue um if i wanted to put this in my vehicle yeah. is it, is it going to ruin my vehicle suspension no. what's it weigh what's it like it weighs 96 pounds and it's batteried it's powered by a lithium-ion battery that's about this big so it really i can I took it out of the back of my truck today with no problem. And the charge of the battery will last how long? So on a full charge, this thing will go 36 holes on a course like this, no problem. As you mentioned, we've got a cooler built in. You've got charging stations built in. We've got the iPad GPS built in. I've got a pretty good-sized golf bag on here. 
and it's not laboring in any way, shape, or no. form to do the work. No, and it won't. A customer of mine, when we were playing in Augusta, he had a staff bag on there, his PGA staff bag, and no problem. And now the final question that I'm sure everybody has, what's it going to set me back to bring one of these home? Well, from a retail standpoint, it's a little over $5,000. From a golf course standpoint, we try to go to market with that from a leasing standpoint. So you have a, an expenditure, and then you have revenue after your expenditures. Um, the lease payment is structured to where if this walk goes out a little over eight times in a month, that's, that's your break-even point, mm -hmm. basically. Which isn't much at all. No, it's really not. They go out a lot. This thing is absolutely mind-blowingly cool, and I can't thank you enough for absolutely. giving us kind of a live test run of what it looks for like. For sure. I really can't put into words how cool this thing is because now it allows me to walk around a golf without the burden of carrying a big bag like that or even pushing it on a cart. This autonomous caddy is the wave not only of the future, but of the present. So well done to our friends at Club Car, to Midwest Golf and Turf, and now it's your turn to get into one of these, the Tempo Walk.